What's a 4th of July celebration without fireworks, right? You might say very quiet. You might be surprised to know that it's illegal for private citizens to set off fireworks in Virginia, with limited exceptions depending on where you live. But as 10 on your side, Saver Hurdle reports sales are doing a booming business across the border. Some for the kids, that's all. Mark Sawyer loads up a bag with various types of fireworks at Border Station. He told us he lives in North Carolina where it's legal for folks to use certain types. He keeps safety in mind. Yeah, we lay out a big uh, perimeter platform and it's probably about 20 feet out away from everything and just let them go off on that. Just got to keep everything from nothing catching on fire, nothing shooting up or blowing out. Fireworks are on sale just about everywhere you look. All carry manufacturers' warning labels. Here in North Carolina, the saying goes, everything that goes up or blows up is illegal. No zoom, no boom. No firecrackers, no M80s, uh, no skyrockets, anything like that. They have to be ground cover. Everything ground cover. You can't go in the air. Here in Virginia, most cities echo the rules put in place at the beach. In the city of Virginia Beach, it's a no tolerance. All fireworks are banned, and that includes for the 4th of July. We encourage the public to go to the... Um, uh, public shows that are out at the oceanfront at Mount Trashmore. He points out that fire risks, including wildfires and injuries, go up when some people set off, then leave fireworks unattended. Then there's this. We have even banned sparklers. Uh, sparklers, we usually give them, they think they're benign. We give them to a four-year-old, and it's a piece of molten metal. They run about 1,800 degrees. He says the aim is to make sure everyone has a safe and enjoyable holiday. Ava Hurdle, 10 on your side.